I'll turn, I'll turn her over. So we're going to go anyhow you want to start, right? In my case, I'll just go into, so I'm in Pescatown. So here's how I would teach my students this. We're going to do, and we might do if they're younger and newer, we might do one move, learn that, the next move, learn that. All right. So that you guys are a little bit more advanced, I'm going to show you all of them. I presume you all know Pescatown, you all know Pescatown. Give you experience. So. I, like Steve says, collect the arm, I go above her elbow. I'm going to get one leg in to lift, and one leg on the outside, and then I'm going to punch the invisible person behind her. And so now I come over here, and I'm in Cassie's arm. Then, she's going to try and get out, so I'm going to shove this arm across her face, and now I'm in Cassie's arm. So now they've got two, a turnover in a second. Thing. Now, she's still trying to get out, so I'm going to come over, and I'm in Tadashi Hotel. And then, this is the fun part. So she's trying to get away, she's pushing with this arm against me. So I'm going to turn right around here, and ju -ju -ju. And the reason I do this, I will be perfectly frank, I do it because when kids do it in a tournament, especially the last part, everyone goes, oh, and when you're in middle school, and you do something, everybody goes, Oh, then that's the major day. So, and the other thing is, it teaches them to do a turnover and three pins and an armbar. And so instead of doing repetition, 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 it's something they feel cool, they feel like they're in pro wrestling, and you can do it in a tournament. You probably won't catch, I've, I've caught some black belts with that, but as a general rule, you're probably not going to, so it's more for, if you're doing a tournament, you're great with somebody who's not that skilled, and you want to impress your friends. And we're like, oh, you should do that. My husband's a huge Simpsons fan. I hate Simpsons. But anyway, there's some part where Bart's talking about how, you know, his kids' friends don't think he's cool, and his father says, who cares what a bunch of third graders think? But, you know, if you're in eighth grade, you care what a bunch of eighth graders think. So, but yeah. Sweet, roll over, has to be Shove it across your face, and get up, cut it down. Get on top, cut it shield down. And you know, this is a perfectly good pin. But I want to be flashy, so she's, she's going to shove that. Usually she's shoving that against your face. <coughs> Notice when I come up, and this is also a good way for teaching them about Juju Katami. You want your body on them like white on rice. Notice when I come up, She's pushing against me, and notice how her arm is on my body this whole time. So. Can I see the last part again one more time? Sure. Just the arm bar? All right. So normally if you have somebody in tight shield, you've got this cranked across their face, and this can be a choke, right? right? So what they're going to be doing is they're going to be trying to shove this arm to get your head away. So she's giving me that arm. So since she's coming here, I'm hooking up above her, I'm hooking at her elbow, and see how my whole body is on her? And my body's on her, So try it. You do it in a tournament, it looks really cool. 